Hello and welcome to the Cinema 4D Quick Tips. Normally when you rig a character or a machine or whatever, you create a ton of user data in order to create your own custom user interface for animation. And you normally do that by going to user data, manage user data, then the manage user data window will pop up. And here you see we already have two sliders and a checkbox. And the way to create additional parameters is to go to add data. So now what we have here is something that we want to call my slider. So we want to create a slider. Then the interface of this value should be also slider or float slider. Now you can see it here in the preview that we already have a slider. And then we want to adjust the minimum of this value to minus 100. So we have got a slider that goes from minus 100% to plus 100%. Let's set this back to zero again. And now you already saw that it's quite a few parameters that we had to set up. And I want to save this whole thing as a preset so we can just reuse it. Therefore, we go to save preset and type in a name. Let's name it percentage slider minus 100, 100 and hit OK. Now, if we want to create more of these sliders, we just have to go to load preset and here is our percentage slider and we add a few more. In the end we hit OK and here are the three sliders that we just created. Now where does Cinema 4D save these presets? It's very easy. They are in the content browser and you can go to the content browser by simply activating this tab here or by going to Window Content Browser. Now you just need to go to User and here is the user data preset folder. Just open it and here is the user data preset that we just stored. And if you want to know where this is located on the hard drive, just right click the user folder and go to show in finder or on Windows show in explorer. And here you see the user lib4d file, which is the library that stores all of the user presets. Thanks for watching. If you enjoy our quick tips, please like, comment and subscribe.